Hi, I'm Mike McNamara with the McNamara Report and In-Depth Focus Labs, and welcome to the performance review of Epson's new ET4550 all-in-one printer. This printer is a great device for small offices or home offices. It allows you to print, copy, scan, and fax. The name gives away another feature to this printer. The ET stands for EcoTank. This is one of the EcoTank system printers that does not use small cartridges like you're used to in all-in-one printers. Instead, as you can see on the side here, there's a protrusion that holds large quantities of inks. In fact, the printer ships with enough ink, according to Epson, to print up to 11,000 black and white documents or 8,500 color documents. And at a cost over time that is far less per print than any other all-in-one inkjet printer in its class and far lower than even laser printers. So let's get into the actual performance of this device and take a look at how these inks work and how you load them and why this is a groundbreaking printer when it comes to the cost per print and the cost over time to anyone with a small business or small office. Let's start with the inks, which come in bottles instead of cartridges. The $499 version I'm testing here includes two large black bottles, three standard CMY, and three smaller bonus CMY bottles. You have to be careful when pouring the inks into the corresponding reservoirs, but you don't have to worry about draining every drop since the cost to replace all four large bottles is just under $60. And by my calculations, that should let you print up to 5,500 black and white or 5,500 color water-resistant documents and incredible savings over cartridge-based ink sets. And once the inks are loaded, it takes about 20 minutes to prime the inks, and that's a great time to load the driver software or fill the 150-sheet capacity paper tray. After the inks are primed and the printer is ready, I highly recommend performing a print head alignment in order to achieve the best print quality. The instructions on the 2.2-inch monitor are easy to follow, and it only takes a few minutes to complete the entire process. That's also the case when connecting the printer to a wireless network, a once daunting task. Just follow the screen prompts and press the WPS button on your router, and in seconds the printer is accessible by any device on the network, including smartphones and tablets. Now it's time to see how the ET4550 performs in standard print, scanning, and copying tests. I'm speeding up the playback of all of these tests to save time, but as you can see, the printer is pretty fast to begin with, popping out the first black and white page in under 9 seconds, and finishing all four black and whites in under 22 seconds. That's faster than most laser printers in its price class, and nearly as fast as a few Epson Workforce Pro models I've tested in the past. The four-page color document also finished quickly, in just 43 seconds. Now, it may be hard to believe that such a compact printer can automatically print on two sides of a page, and in the process save users up to half on paper supplies, plus save on mailing costs. But as you can see for yourself, the ET4550 does so effortlessly and only adds about 30% more time to a four-page print document compared to one-side printing. This performance blows away any laser printer in its class and is faster than any competitive all-in-one inkjet printer. Close examination of both one- and two-sided documents reveal very sharp font edges, with one-sided results rivaling laser printer fonts. However, two-sided fonts and graphs have slightly lower contrast and ink density, probably done to reduce bleed-through on plain paper. The ET4550 can also print color and black and white photos on either coated matte or glossy photo papers. Speed is moderately high, with best quality 8x10s taking about 3.5 minutes on either paper to complete, and 4x6 about 1.5 minutes. Image quality is respectable on both paper surfaces. However, color accuracy and maximum black densities are slightly better on matte paper, and results can be improved on both using custom profiles. Color gamut volume is higher on glossy paper, and lower than what you'd find on four and six color dedicated inkjet photo printers. In most offices, the ET4550's ability to automatically copy up to 35 documents will be a far more popular feature than printing photographs. Copying can easily be done without using a PC, and while it's not as fast as most dedicated black and white copiers, its ability to copy either a four page black and white or color document in just over a minute is impressive for such a compact device. The time it takes to copy a single 8x10 photo using the glass flatbed is also quite short, and instead of printing, the scans can actually be sent directly to cloud folders or to a PC. The ET4550 is also able to copy up to 35 one-sided documents to two-sided output and help save on paper costs. Direct scan and copy quality can vary depending on the original document or photo condition, but can be tweaked using a variety of controls on the 2.2-inch monitor 
including adjusting borders, dry time, and print density. You can also scan directly to cloud folders or to a PC. But if you have any treasured, faded photos, you're better off scanning from your PC. That's because Epson has included its powerful color restoration feature in the scan driver, along with the ability to crop and zoom in on scan previews. With just the click of a button, you can dramatically improve faded photos and save yourself hours of retouching and color correction. I know that was a lot to absorb in such a short amount of time, but the bottom line on Epson's new Workforce ET4550 is that, well, quite frankly, this is the kind of device that any small business or home office owner will love. Its compact size allows it to be placed just about anywhere. It comes with a great scanner and software package, and the EcoTank ink system, during the life of this printer, you'd probably be able to pay back any of the premium that you paid for it in savings, and then some. If you want more information on this printer, click on the link to my left, and thanks for watching.